imagining this amazing breakfast that I was gonna have and I don't have any honey. So <laughs> it's not gonna taste that great. And I'm like, should I put sugar? But then it defeats the purpose of it being a healthy breakfast because it's plain yogurt, coconut flakes. Oh, walnuts. I have to add walnuts and green apple. And now I'm just gonna add honey. And we don't have honey. So that breakfast was actually not bad. And I think it's because of the sweetness of the apple. It was good. It was a good sweetness. So before, well, I think I am going to go grocery shopping. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a list of things I need before I go grocery shopping because I hate going without a list because either one, I forget something or two, I overspend and just buy like things I don't need and it's just like sweets and stuff because I'm just so hungry when I go. Oh, I also really like their soup. So I'm gonna get a soup. I like the minestrone soup. That sounds really good. And if they don't have that, I'll get clam chowder. I have not meal prepped in over a month and it always kills me when I don't because then I regret it during the week. The good thing is that this week I'm just working four days. So I'm working from 8.30 to 5. I brought my other jacket because it's gonna be, well, it's already, it's sprinkling right now, but I think when I get out, it's like seriously gonna be raining. And this is not gonna protect me from the rain. So, oh, there's my energy drink. Now I have two energy drinks in here. Okay. I thought, I was like, who the heck took my energy drink from my lunch bag? <sighs> Bring a little bit of brightness to your day. That's affordable. I ended up stopping at Trader Joe's. <sighs> I am so happy. Let me show you guys what I got. Of course, my onion rings, which I love these. I've showed them before. I also saw these at the counter and I was like, oh, that sounds good. I'm hungry, of course. I also love getting this granola, almond butter granola with my yogurt. I picked up some coconut whipped cream. Um, got some turkey for sandwiches. Got some biscuits, because I like to have them just in case I were to want a biscuit. And minestrone soup, it's really good. The honey that I told you guys I wanted to get um, earlier this morning. I got some chicken sausage for breakfast. My green onion pancakes. You guys know I love this. I shared it in the previous vlog. Got some Swiss cheese. Avocado, but they're still like green like they're not ready yet so i need to wait until they're ripe and i got pizza this one's actually really good so i just finished air frying the salmon with some cheese bread this is from trader joe's i bought it last time i went and i still have some i had forgotten about these so i'm gonna heat this up i don't want it to go bad so i'm just gonna air fry it I'm going to do some cheese. I might as well just do it all, you know? I'm going to do it. Alright, so the broccoli's in there. I'm going to do these in here. Pray it doesn't burn. Okay. It looks good. It looks good. I hope. Oh, even the broccoli's good. This one right here is my lunch. So I put rice in here, but I don't have rice in here. So I'm like, eh, I'll just eat some of these uh, little cheese breads. I am out of work, you guys. Work was good. It went by really slow. I feel like it did. It was busy, but it just feels like slow because I keep thinking that tomorrow is Friday, but it's not. But anyways, I am actually going to go pick up my cousin at the airport. So I have like an hour and a half to kill after work. So... I decided to come to this bakery that I've never been to and I've been wanting to come to. So I'm going to meet up my friend here and I'm just waiting for her. And I'm actually really excited because the place looks so cute. <laughs> I feel 
like this has been the slowest week ever and I am just ready to take time off. It is raining and it's actually going to be raining all week, all weekend and I think part of next week but I'm just happy it is finally Friday because ever since like Tuesday or Wednesday I was already thinking it was Friday and it wasn't. So I am going to work today and hoping it goes by really really fast because I am over this week, you know, I'm not always like in a very like happy mood and today's one of those weeks where it, it's not, it has not been a good week for me and I just want it to be the weekend already. So anyways, the only good thing is that I got paid today and I already made like multiple transfers to my savings because I... As soon as I find out like how much I'm gonna get in my check midweek, then I schedule transfers for Friday so that they automatically go into my savings account on payday and I don't think about it and um, that means I'm not gonna spend that money because I'm just gonna go into my savings. So that's what I like to do. So that's like the only good thing about this week so far. Um, for me, I feel like saving money and finances has become something that's very fun with some people must, might find it that it's very, I don't know, they don't like to budget or they don't like to save, etc. But for me, it's like super, super fun. I love it. And it's like, I love like when I get to that end goal, that's like my favorite part when I check off, okay, I have already like saved up X amount in this um, specific account so I love that so anyways that's the only good thing about this week that it's payday today and I have already uh, made multiple transfers to my saving accounts I love that I love that but anyways let's head out to work um, today is an 8 30 to 5 I worked all week 8 30 to 5 so we're gonna go to work and hopefully kind of let it go by really fast. I hope it goes by really, really fast today. I cannot believe I've already been off of work since like Tuesday. It's already been four days and it literally feels like I'd, I've been gone for a very long time. I don't know why. I think I just got used to like being there like Monday through Friday. I decided to just take a little break off of work and then go back at it next week. Um, just because I don't know how long this will last. Maybe another month until they hire somebody new. And then after that, it's going to be like, I'm not going to be working too many days. Um, because they'll hire somebody. So that's why I'm like, let me take a break and then go at it for another month. I'm thinking another month. I don't know. It could be less than that. That's why I've been working like this since January because the availability is definitely there. And that's why I was like, oh, might as well just work it, you know? I haven't left my house Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday because I just was not feeling it. Not in the mood to go out. And honestly, I wasn't feeling it today either. But I ended up working out, which was like the best decision ever. I'm so glad I did. If not, I would have been like so screwed <laughs> and tired. So I'm glad I work out. I'm glad I did it. I'm definitely glad I did it. And it feels so good to be back. I've actually been working out every day since Tuesday. But today I really needed it because I didn't really want to go out. But I had already committed and told my cousin, like, yeah, we'll go out. um, Because we're going to go to the airport. This is going to be the second time I go to the airport this in this vlog. I don't know why. That's so weird. I haven't been in the airport since last year. And now I've already been to the airport twice in a week. That is very interesting. Well, it'll be my second time because I'm going to go um, pick up my cousin. But anyways, let's see what else we do today. I do have to run some errands. Oh, I ordered something on Amazon. Let me show you guys, actually. I don't want to drop it. I ordered something on Amazon. I ordered this. Clinique, I think it's take the day off. It's a cleansing balm, 
but it literally came in this bag and it was not like secured it wasn't like closed it wasn't in a box it wasn't anything and then when i opened it let me show you when i opened it it literally was just like that it doesn't look like it's used but it was not sealed so i was like heck no so i'm gonna go return this i'm taking this to ups because i'm not gonna use that if it's not sealed and i'm also gonna go over to xfinity to return this thing that we're not using the xfinity flex I haven't I, I got it last year because apparently there was like a deal or something but I never even like put it on my tv because we already had like amazon I was gonna say amazon flex amazon fire here and I have the roku in my room so it's like pointless so I'm like I'm just gonna return it and this is your reminder actually you guys because let me remind you of something make sure you are looking at your like statements like this is for my my internet bill that's xfinity um that's my carrier and well i looked and of course it's a new year so they upped the price by almost 30 dollars and i was like what the heck so i called them and i was like might as well return it so i'm gonna go return that thing but i got my bill down from like 149 to 109 because i told them i wanted like a better deal because i was like i was paying 120 like two months ago and now it's like 149 <laughs> like what the heck so i ended up getting my internet bill lowered to 109 which i was like thank goodness so if you haven't noticed they xfinity at least did increase their rates so call them and tell them you want like a good deal since you've been a customer for a while because that's what i did and it got me down i got better like faster internet and less of a monthly rate i used to never pay attention to this stuff until last year when i started like legit being aware of my finances and stuff and now i'm like no i'm not gonna pay 149 dollars when it was 120 and now here we are. We got it down to 109. So I'm going to go return that. So that's your reminder. If you have Xfinity or probably any other like internet carrier, take a look at your uh, your statements. Because especially like with me, I just do like automatic payments. So I'm not really paying attention, but I pretty much look at least once, at least once a week at my bank statements and all that and see like what's going on and that's how i caught it because i was like what the heck this bill went up really high so anyways that's a reminder make sure you're looking at that and call them and get a better deal